to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT9. I might take explosive. Well, let's crack into another one. TNT. Yo. Did you hear about the drama that went on at OpenAI this, la- this week, this last week? Uh, Something about their chairman being fired and then okay. getting his job back? So so what happened was, yeah, tell, so I didn't know tell, this about OpenAI. Open AI, open AI was started as a nonprofit. Yes. And and uh, yes. And part of the thing with open AI was like that they didn't want to like make AI evil. They didn't want to like monetize it, all that kind of stuff. They are now a capped for profit business. Like mm-hmm. they can make profit, but like they can't make indefinite gains. Because I, I think in, I I hear it like you were like we don't want this to be evil and have money drive us to. Yes, Dude, because with because AI you can get real evil real quick, right? Yeah. What is uh, it? What do we do? Communism? What do we do here? Capitalism. Capitalism, capitalism bad. Yes, I feel you. It's a wild ass commercial. AI <laughs> McDonald's commercial. Gotta, oh, gotta, yeah, you got to you got to tune into tune into. I can't even. I can't even AI tune into the YouTube to see it. Holy shit! This is the most disgusting, weird thing I've ever. <laughs> anyways, so so basically, why they the, the board of directors of. Uh, open AI, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. they were having a disagreement with, Alt, uh, I can't remember his first name, Altman. Mm-hmm. He was their CEO. Yeah. It says he was fired by open AI's board on Friday following disagreements on how fast to develop and monetize AI. Yeah. yeah so yeah, they yeah, yeah. literally pull the power play yeah. by using the board of directors to fire the CEO because he did not want to make as much money as they did. Yeah. So they fired him and put somebody else in. It caused a giant uproar. And like it was like I think a they put someone in as interim CT, yeah. CEO. Like I think almost every employee in the company signed an open letter that was saying like if you don't bring him back, we're it, all going to quit. It was crazy. It was like Even this interim CEO signed it too. It was like 90% of their staff. Yeah. It was insane how many people had signed it. There. And then Microsoft was like that's fine, we'll just hire him. Because OpenAI yep. was for Microsoft anyway, so Microsoft, yeah. we'll just bring them on on our own then. Yeah. So they hired him as like a power play move. Like, yep, 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 y'all yep, then, yep. we'll just hire him. And then they backtracked, and now he's back. But I feel like, but I, and they, they cleared the board. They made all the board members resign. And, uh, and, and so they're going to have a new board. And, but that's some wild shit, man. Like, that is, <laughs> that is like, the greed the greed is absolutely disgusting. that is yeah it's the it's the grossest thing i've ever seen and i wonder and i wonder like what what board of directors is going to go strictly against the fact that you're a nonprofit to try to they want to squeeze as much as they can fit in that money cap bro you know? it's it's and so, that's the problem with the world today the, it's a lot of greed man it's a lot of greed it's all and i get it Companies have value to the shareholders yes. to make money. That is that is literally what shareholders are, is they support the company monetarily with the idea that they are going to get a return on their investment via, via stock price or whatever. Mm-hmm. Get it. But it's not profit at all costs. And that's mm. how people run business today. It's how much can we make no matter what, no matter who we affect, how we affect the world. It should be like, hey – we're destroying the planet by making this much money because we're doing this. Maybe we should think about, hey, we just laid off a ton of people because we're struggling and we need to make more profit and we'll just make more people do more work and fire people to make more money. Yeah. It's like you got – there's a balance of yeah. – there's ethics involved, right? Like, I mean even beyond ethics, this is one of the like the best like just Robin Hood stories I've ever heard in my life. This is like a super makes me feel good, man, because it's like the person that wants to keep everything free for the people – wins over the the chairmen of the board the evil corpo group this is the most beautiful story man it really is like it puts faith back in the humanity it also shows you the power of the masses man well yeah. we, we have that power well yeah i mean like i mean i i just i thought it was very interesting like the whole company banded behind like that yeah. only tells you how respected and good of a leader that dude is because if not if people hated him they'd be like later yeah. and he stood for the right thing man yeah when it comes exactly down to it, he stood for adhering to the what they promised the consumer in the first well, place it, in i mean i think uh 
I don't remember exactly, but like when Google started a long time ago, their fucking mantra was just don't be evil. And now they're like one of the biggest, most evil entities. Like, yeah, yeah. And once you like, get big and enough, that's how shit can change. It's like you can start with the best intent. And that's what's scary about all these AI companies is they all start with the best intentions. Mm -hmm. And then when they see billions of dollars in the front of their eyes, mm -hmm. they get greedy and they're like, well, just this once. Then just this twice, just this. Th now we're now we're making AI that murders people or selling it to communists and like whatever, right? Like, yeah, yeah somebody yeah. somebody will sell AI technology to Russia because they're gonna get rich. They yeah. don't care what Russia does with it. No, they're gonna be like, I have access to it. You want to pay me a hundred million dollars? Great, I'm set for life, and you do whatever. Just don't kill me with it. Yeah, yeah. I always like to think of a business. You know how the whole thing is like businesses are people. Like how that's a thing. So like they get certain like tax breaks or whatever. Oh yeah. Corporations are essentially entities. So yeah. no one's responsible for like what they do. Yeah. So the ridiculous. truth is like if a person got as big as a corporation, the amount of damage they would do to take a single step. We take a single step. What do we kill underneath our foot? We kill maybe like, I don't know, some sales, maybe a bug or something. Yeah, step on a snail that climbed on the side. We're not causing right? that much damage. Yeah, but right. if we get as big as Microsoft, then to make a single footsteps, you're destroying entire blocks. You right, know, you're right. You're everything you do. You're putting smaller businesses out of yep. out of business because yep. you're taking that share. Like look at Walmart. How many like small mom and pop places they exactly. put out of business? Exactly. And then the fucked up part is they go there, they put a Walmart in, and maybe it doesn't work, and then they just close it, and then there's nothing left. There's no store left there because they all the other stores closed. Like a big hulking beast. They just they just want to sit down in your town, and they took out the it's entire like city block of stores. Yeah, it's literally like they took a step, and they kind of stood there for a minute, and then they just lifted their foot out again, and then yep. path of destruction. <laughs> just the path of destruction, but yeah. there's a Walmart. <laughs> yeah, but now it's closed, and now it's just a big empty-ass building. <laughs> yeah, 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 because brick and mortar's out of business. Right, right. Everybody else is gone so it, it 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 is a good story in the fact that like the quote unquote good guy wins but, yeah but here's how i feel about that i feel mm -hmm. like this is a giant turning point because what if what if homeboy decides to turn evil then i think that he, he's going to have to they fought to bring him back in and now he's ruined the world or whatever right? i think that he's going to negotiate with him if nothing else well, they're gone. The board's gone. They put a new board in. Oh, they put a new board they, in. They made all the other board. They they, yeah. they called for his reinstatement and for the board to resign. See now, they, they, so now it's just like a time play. It's like, how long is it going to take to get this guy out of here? How long are we going to have to make it? I don't know. Well, right. Or is something going to corrupt him eventually? I mean, yeah. Yeah. Whenever you put a lot of power into a single person's hand, you deal with the, uh, the duality of human nature, which is good and evil. So, yeah, there's going to be a lot of a lot of gray there, too. I'm like, he's probably no saint. He probably, like, watches weird sex stuff on the yeah, internet or, or he, something. Yeah, he does something else. He beats his kids or something yeah, i don't know he you know beats his mean? kids for fin not finishing their ice cream yeah right like, like what kind of dad are you i don't know what he does but i don't want to put anything crazy on his jacket good for him for achieving the unthinkable beating the evil corpro getting the job keeping open ai open and uh giving me faith in humanity again yeah but it's it still freaks me out with all the ai does it yeah. Why? What's wrong with AI? That's, I mean, we talked this week earlier about aliens, and that we is, did. yeah, there's a lot of proof. Still not, still not like, there's no definitive. AI is hmm. real. And, <laughs> and it is. AI is real. AI is real. I've seen today. AI can do a lot of damage, mm -hmm. and people are out here just developing it willy nilly, and no one is regulating it. And what like, do you think is the most damaging portion of it? Do you think it the most damaging portion is the disinformation it can yes, cause? I think or, that is. I think that's initially what the well, bad part is. Right. Yes. Eventually, it could be a lot worse. But I think the initial thing is misinformation. You can do deep fakes. You can make people look like they're saying things they don't say. You can make people look like they're doing things they didn't do. You can, mm. like, and like, for you and I, no one's going to make a video of us saying something wild. We're just two guys. But, like, it's like the video of the Pope wearing the big coat, the whatever, the, the mm. Trump saying this, Biden saying this videos that you can't really tell it's different. You can because the AI is not that good yet. The Drake it, song. Get, yeah, right? Give it five years. Shit's going to be wild. Like people – like even just deep fakes from five years ago to now are so much different. And like they're, like we just literally had on the video of an AI Jenner McDonald's commercial. Yeah, it looked wild and mm -hmm. it looked fucked up. Give it ten years, it's you're they're gonna be able to AI generate like movies. Like you're gonna put people out of business. It's it's 
it's weird. So I'll give one more account because I know we, we are short on time. It's real quick. But you, you are right. Is that people are definitely going to take AI and use it for the most sinister reasons ever. I heard about the story of a guy or a, I should say, I shouldn't even say a guy, but I should say a group of people who are creating AI generated uh, CP. Oh. And they were oh. sharing that. And it's like. Right, right. And, it, and then that comes the morality question. Is that illegal? Because it's not real. Yeah. It's like, it, it would be like doing that with like anime. Like it's essentially AI created stuff is, is high end anime. Uh, that's, that's, that's too much though. That's too much. But at the man. same time, if they can do that and not harm real. Oh, uh, but it, come on, bro, man. Like, it, it's a. This is it's enabling to me, man. This is just yeah. making coke free. Yeah. This is craft <laughs> cocaine <laughs> to me, man. Hey, call back. <laughs> Anyways, that yeah, it's wild, dude. It's just it the possibilities are scary. That's what it is. Like it I is. feel like if it's used for good, great, but people always use shit for exactly. not Exactly. And and the the worst thing they can do, they're going to do it. Exactly. The worst thing so, they can do, they're going to. Yep, do. exactly. So, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Go to the crazytown.com for Jonas. TNT. Oh, uh, yeah.